your feelings versus their feelings. We haven't done this for a very long time, so let's have a peek. Spirit, for the viewer, please. For the viewer, what is the viewer's feelings, please? What are the viewer's feelings, please? Okay, we have got Nine of Pentacles and Magician. And for the person on the viewer's mind, please, their feelings, please, their feelings. Okay, let's take two cards there. We have got the Ten of Wands and the Sun card. This may be a very exciting time in your life as you are working on manifestations. You may feel eager and motivated to have things happen between you and your person. You may feel that God or the universe or your higher self, whichever term you prefer, is working with you at this time to help all of your dreams come true. I have said it before with this particular magician card, it is very different from the traditional decks in that this card makes manifestation look effortless. You see the swan here, this is symbolic of lifetime partnership, as swans mate for life. We see the top hat that looks like a home, and the fact that she is so high above the land makes me feel like there could potentially be travel. So all of these things may be on your mind, a home, a long-term relationship, travel, and with the Nine of Pentacles, you may have recently gone through a glow up or you may be going through one currently. You may be in a place of peace and contentment. As this card looks so serene, her earrings remind me of chakra points and of them being in alignment. Therefore, you might be working on the physical, the mental and the spiritual aspects of your life. So actually I get the energy that you are working mainly on yourself at this moment and understanding that these manifestations are on their way to you and there is this sense of confidence around that. For their feelings we have the Ten of Wands. Traditionally this is a card of carrying too many burdens and coming to the end of that cycle. However, if we look at the illustration on this card does it not very much look like they are building something together, working together to create a home? So this person may feel that they want to create a home with you and that you would both work very well together, especially when it comes in combination with the Sun card, which is often known as the happiest card in the deck. Two who are dancing and celebrating after all of the work has been done. This is a card of happiness and healing and celebration. I think that your person believes that you both have a very bright future together. So many possibilities. The little bottles that they are holding in their hands look like the infinity symbol. A card of infinite possibilities. So for your feelings, we have the Six of Swords and their feelings we have the Nine of Cups. The Six of Swords is a card that speaks of moving into calmer waters. As I look at the card and I see the star and the anchor, it feels like there is a goal in sight and you have almost reached it. And this may have been after a time of turbulence if we look at these dark clouds. So it feels like you may be in a place of serenity or just entering a very serene period in your life. For their feelings, a wish come true. The Nine of Cups is all about personal wish fulfillment. And as we saw in the Sun card, they both look like cards of celebration. This is someone who is putting in effort to create something very beautiful for you. For your feelings, we have the Ten of Pentacles. And for their feelings, we have... <laughs> the Ten of Cups. You guys are on the same page. The Ten of Pentacles, you are thinking about something long term. You see the rings on the trees mark the years that you wish to spend together. You may feel that you desire to grow old with this person. Perhaps have a family or share your families 
and have a family home, a place to build a legacy together. This is a card of commitment, as is this one. I had said that they are preparing something for you, and here we see with the Ten of Cups, another celebration. And I know that we have seen this card quite frequently recently, but does it not look like a wedding celebration? While the Nine of Cups is a card of personal wish fulfillment, the Ten of Cups is a card of collective wish fulfillment. Something that not only makes them happy, but also makes you and others around the both of you extremely happy. There are toasts being made and confetti thrown. Just as you see long-term future together, so do they. If you would like to learn about what their feelings are towards you, there is a link in my bio to private readings.